Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Cold. I'm back with yet another FIFA 15 video. And today, we're going to be looking at episode 2 of Trading to Tima the Season Terry. Now, you might be a little confused because last episode was De Gea. But I have some things to explain because, yeah, well, here's the, uh, here's the reasons, obviously. Because I haven't traded in close to two months. I haven't traded on and off, but it's been quite difficult for me to find lots of good trades. So, I would prefer to start a smaller player as PlayStation. He goes for 75k, and he doesn't sell on that, so he might go down. So, anyways, guys, that's the reason why I might edge it to a bigger player. No, not might, but I definitely will go into some bigger players. Uh, just ever going up by slight, slightly, like, uh, John Terry to Matic, Matic to Belize, stuff like that. Um, then we're gonna try and create a really nice club full of informed team seasons and other special cards So yeah, let's get into the trades So as you guys can see we have a full trade pile of Barclays Premier League silvers now we bought this Vergini Vergini I believe it's called or he, it, he is said so anyways, that's not the point We're going to be listing that Vergini up for 950 bought him for, buy him for 800 We have the Sinclair we bought him for 1300 and we're going to sell him on for 2100 coins no, 2,300 coins. This Colossus, yet again, we're trading with him yet again. He used to be rare, like I said before, but he just isn't rare anymore because, you know, all these silver team of the seasons coming out. Um, not all of them. There's not a whole lot an anymore because of the, the championship was out, but not anymore. But, uh, yeah, so Zuma, we picked him up for 3,100. We're going to list him up for 4,600, making 1,400 coins. The Coyote for a thousand. We're going to list them up for. I don't. I think it's not that much profit, but it's going to be nineteen hundred coins, nine hundred before tax, which is uh, nothing you can complain about. We're gonna pick up this Given. He used to be quite expensive, but well, before price changes, he was five thousand. But now he's only going for six hundred coins, which is actually kind of sad. But you know, whatever. We're going with this Nathan Ake. He has three hundred coins, and we're going to list him up for eight hundred and fifty coins. There's Danny Ings we picked up for three hundred, and we're also going to list him out for, if I'm correct, it was only a thousand coins. But um, I guess it's less to see. Yeah, I was right. Okay. Anyways, we're going to go to this Mayuka. We bought him for five hundred fifty. If I'm correct, we're going to list him up for twelve hundred. Now Mayuka, that ninety pace looks pretty tasty. I trade with him a lot, I just have not used him in game before. We're going to go with Ki Sung Young, the rare silver from Swansea. Uh, we're going to list him up for around 1,200 coins, I believe. Uh, we might have another one if I'm... Yeah, there he is. We're going to list that one up for 1,100. We're going to go for Townsend. We bought him for 950. He's going to list up for around 1,500. Not that much profit, but it's still some coins to work with. So we're going with this Kuyate. We bought this one for 750 coins. We're listed it up for around 1,800. And then we're going to move into the last two players of the trade pile, which is another Ki Sung Young and a Mayuka. So we bought this one for 450 coins, and we're going to list him up for 1,100. Still, we're just undercutting ourselves right there, and we're going to go to this Mayuka, and we're going to list him up for 1,000 coins, undercutting ourselves yet again. So we are still both the same... Or we're both, I have both the cheapest Mayukas on the market of the PlayStation. So, anyways, guys, as you guys can see, we're going to look on it. 14 things have sold. That's everything in the trade pile. And we are we were at 21,000 coins. So, we did make 10,000 coins on that batch. So, we're going to go on and we're going to try some more non-rare golds uh, to trade with. We're going to list them out for 750. We have a Robbie Cruz, the Australian, I believe it is, from Bayer Leverhusen. Uh, we bought him for 300. Look at the double R coins at 600. We go with a Wilfred Zaha. We bought him for 550 coins. We're going to list him for 2,000. Almost quadrupling our coins, I believe. But uh, that 50 kind of throws it off. So anyways, we're going to go to this Ward Prowse. We bought him for 500. We're going to list him up for triple. And uh, as you guys will see later, he does not sell. But in the end, we're going to end up making more coins because we relisted him for higher. As the next minimum was a little bit higher than the time. So we're going to go to this Mayuka. We're doing a little bit more of that non-gold, but that's not really something to talk about, of course, because it's just mass pitting. We're going to buy this Mayuka for 750 put him up for 1000 The Schmelzer for 600 Now, this was incredible. I, I I hadn't noticed that it had gone up so much. It went up to 1,400 coins I ended up selling it for on the first thing or on the first list, which is pretty amazing. We go with this Pisano. He is for 550 coins. We're going to list him up for 1,200. He's got 90 pace at right back, which is incredible. Now, this is the deal of the episode. We're going with an... I believe his name is Eric Durham. If I'm incorrect, please tell me. 
We bought him for 1,200 coins. We're looking to make 3,000 coins at 4,200 coins, which is absolutely incredible. Our deal of the series, and of course, we're in the early stages, so uh, yeah. We're going to list this variety up for variety, variety, some, 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 some. Yeah, okay, never mind. <laughs> Thought I'd go for some. But we bought that one for 450, looking up to sell them off for 900. We're going this Ander Herrera. We bought it for 350, and we're going to sell them on for 750. Just more mass bidding. Nothing really you can say about that. It's just um, a method that works a lot. So I prefer to trade with it because it's quick coins. I've said it so many damn times, but. Yeah, we're gonna go into this Munir, the right, the upgraded White Wing. We bought it for a thousand. We're gonna list them up for nineteen hundred, nine hundred coins before tax. Now we're going to go with this Dajuru. Now two hundred and fifty coins, and we sell them for eighteen hundred on the first list, which is incredible. Personally, I was not expecting that because I traded him before price ranges, and he was going for only a thousand coins. And then somehow, in between the span of a month, he went up around a thousand coins, which doesn't seem very much, but it's something to look out for. So yeah, we're going into this cock. Coquillin, Coquillin, I don't know. The, the French guy from uh, Arsenal. And uh, we bought him for 750. We're going to sell him off for 1500. We've also bought another one. I believe we either listed it for 1600 or 1400. We undercut ourselves. But, anyways, we got this Danny Yings. We bought him for 350 coins. And we're going to list him on for around 800 to 1000 coins, which we do. And that gives us. A decent amount of profit. And this Grey Dell we bought for 950 coins. And we're going to look to sell him on for 1900. Which unfortunately he, which unfortunately he does not. And as you guys will see later. We do have to list him, relist him up at 1800 coins. Which is only 100 less. But uh, you know it's fine. We get that well back. And that's the last trade of the batch. And as you guys can see everything did go on and sell. We are sitting on 31,000 coins. With three things still selling. Meaning we have around 3500 coins. Or 35,000 coins excuse me. And guys that is the end of the video. If you guys did enjoy it. I hope you did because, you know, I enjoy making. This is awesome. I love these. It gets me posting still. So anyways, that's, that's the end. If you guys liked it, please drop a like. It's always appreciated. Subscribe if you are not already, and I will see you guys later.